Welcome to Credit Fitness 1980 and welcome to today's video. So today's video, it's long overdue. Um, it's my mommy makeover, two years anniversary. Well, actually two years was April, so right now we in almost June. So it's a little bit about two years and two months since I did my mommy makeover. Um, if you are new here, welcome to my channel and please don't forget to subscribe and join the Curly Fitness 1980. I'm all about health and fitness and I'm going to a journey right now and I want to take you guys along the way with me and for future journey because I think, um, you know, we all have some kind of journey we go through in life and by sharing my journey with you guys, it's pretty much, I want it to, um, inspire, motivate and then every single woman out there who might be going through anything in life that you think it's impossible to overcome and i'm hoping my story can inspire you guys so with that being said thank you so much for all my subscribers who's been with me since day one i love you guys so much it means so much to me um so today video i'm not gonna be showing you guys my breasts because when i did the mommy makeover i did it with you know my breasts my stomach and everything so I'm not going to be showing you guys my breasts because um, if you haven't watched my last week video, I will put the link down up, up here or in the description box so you guys can check um, the video where I have been. So therefore, I, I, you know, I explain exactly what's going on and I will be doing another video um, going through more about breast implant illness because I'm planning on taking them out. So with that being said, so today I'm just going to focus on the stomach and then the scar and also my daughter's at school and the girls are taking a nap so i have to do this video before they wake up um because if not it's not gonna happen so um i'm gonna have to do it by myself so in other words you're not gonna see my head when i'm gonna show you guys the score so um so it's been two years and two months since i did the mommy makeover everything is going very good um i'm thankful i'm happy with my result and also every single one of you guys who might be thinking about a mommy makeover um let me give you guys a very short details about my story in case if you haven't watched my whole mommy makeover which i will put the playlist on the description box and maybe in the card up here so you guys can check it out as well so when i did my mommy makeover it was only because after giving birth to the twins my body was stretched out i had loose skin i did not do any liposuction because um i live a very healthy lifestyle so um this is why i had to do my mommy makeover because of the loose skin and also i had hernia so and again um my mommy makeover was just because of that reason um we all have different journey in life so whatever your reason is make sure once you go to that big surgery make sure you take care of yourself to your best ability i'm very big on you know do whatever makes you happy but how many time you have to go under the knife if you are not satisfied with the result because you haven't been taking care of yourself and prior to that i was a fitness competitor so that pretty much explained my story very briefly <laughs> okay so now guys i'm gonna go ahead and keep this video very short i'm just gonna show you guys my score also i'm not doing any kind of like score um gel or anything like that all i'm using right now is like shea butter and then sometimes i use um avocado oil on my skin i love to use natural oils which i did a video on that i probably will put that video up there too so you guys can check it out which i did already so i use a lot of natural oil which kind of like also eventually will help with scarring um dog spot and all that stuff on your skin so i'm gonna go ahead and show you guys the scar and how my stomach is looking i want to do a scar revision but i'm not 100 percent sure yet i'll let you guys know if i do decide to do a scar revision it's probably gonna be with my explant surgery because like i said this is my last surgery um i'm not doing any more surgery i am done and over with it so if i'm doing a scar revision it's probably gonna be with when i'm doing the explant surgery so with that being said let's go ahead and show you guys the scar and my belly <laughs> okay guys so i hope this is good let me see if i can zoom in for you guys all right perfect okay so this is my scar And then this side, I'll zoom in here so you guys can see. Okay. Okay. 
Now this is where I'm thinking on doing the revision on it right there because I want that to be just as thin as right here. And also I wanted to do it right there. But and again, my husband think I'm with it. I'm crazy. My daughter think I'm crazy. My friend think I'm crazy. You guys can tell me what you think. And also right now I'm very bloated. Um, I'm on my time of the month. Whew. Yeah, so hey guys, so my batteries are about to die on me. Um, so this is it. That's it for the scar. If you guys have any question, please leave them down in the comment below. Um, I hope this helped. Um, some of you guys who might want to know exactly how your scar is going to look. Bottom line, you're going to have a scar forever. It's not going to go away, but over time you can do things to make it very um, light, um, small, you know, thinner or whatever you have to do. Or you can, you might have to have a revision. So these are the things that comes with tummy tuck. This is the reason why taking care of yourself is so important so you don't have to go through that. But pregnancy changed everybody's body's different. So pregnancy can change things, which is that happened to me. So, and again, I want to keep this video short because my battery is about to die on me. So as always, guys, be you, be fit, be blessed. Have a wonderful day, and I'll see you guys on my next video. Bye.